This is my tinfoil hat. It will protect me from the government uh, rays trying to do mind reading and trying to um, get inside me and infect this review. Hey, what's up you guys? Thank you for checking back in again. My name is Ryan and this is Lake City Cannabis where we make cannabis videos and you watch them. It's another strain review that we're bringing you today. I am super excited but ultra nervous to bring you this strain review. It comes with an extra level of caution. So make sure you turn on those VPNs. Make sure you turn off the lights, close your windows because the government the government is out there and they're watching for us. We are going to be bringing you MK Ultra from Aurora. That's the MK Ultra Indica strain. And I think if we're going to do it, I need to have a little protection. I'm feeling a little insecure. Um, if you don't know what MK Ultra is, it was a CIA experiment where they were messing with people's heads. So to make sure that we are protected, I have prepared something for us. Hold on one second. Through the magic of editing let's grab this this is my tinfoil hat it's going to protect me from the mk ultra experiments from the cia and the government trying to get inside my head and affect the thoughts that's not happening today we've got our tinfoil hat that's how i'm wearing this whole i'm gonna wear this whole damn time i don't give a shit. this is happening okay mk ultra here it is right now we're gonna open it up for you okay so as we crack this open here, it has the top sealer, so hopefully that's kept some of the freshness in. When we pop this open, as is tradition, we will only smell, we will not look right away, we will only smell for you. And then we will have a look, and we'll get to it. All right, so here we go, we're gonna pop this open. We should be getting a mix here now. MK Ultra is a mix of OG, Kush, and G13. It should be earthy, it should be woody, it should be a little bit of pungent, so. I'm not getting anything into the official snap there. All right. I'm actually getting a little bit of floral scent coming off this, but it is woody. It is earthy. Probably more woody than anything. Pull the sucker out here. All right. Now, so far, a really nice looking, tightly packed indica bud. What we would come to expect. It is crystally. It definitely has that woody, earthy smell to it, but again, getting that floral off there. How dry is it? Ooh, it's pretty dry. It is definitely a bit dry. Maybe just test out one other one in here, just see what we get. No, no, she's pretty dry. Good thing I got my tinfoil hat on, so nobody's getting in on this dryness that's here. So, a little bit dry, but the smell is nice. Visual is there, really pretty. What is the obvious next step? Well, let's go and vape it. So vape is loaded, it's warming up, but before I jump into that, I wanted to talk to you about sponsorship. Probably not a good idea while I'm wearing a tinfoil hat, but what the hell. If you have a cannabis product and you want to advertise this channel, there is a great opportunity to reach a lot of awesome people in the cannabis industry. Great B2B opportunities and awesome opportunities just for anybody on the channel. If you want that, throw a comment down below, hit me up on my email, be a part of the Lake City Cannabis family. All right, so vape is warmed up, it's loaded, MK Ultra in here. We should be tasting earthy notes and woody notes, but I do want to give you a heads up. MK Ultra is known for being a very sedative, strong strain. So if this is your first time around the block, I wouldn't recommend it. Not a good one to jump into. But for me, we're all right. Let's jump into it, taste it out, here we go. <coughs> so first initial assessment off the MK Ultra from Aurora. Definitely that dryness is hitting me with the smoke, a little bit harsh on the lungs right away. Um, definitely getting that woody and pungent taste. There is like a hint of bitterness going on that I can't quite place. It almost feels kind of chemically. Like it almost has this slight feeling of, of hints of Gorilla Glue, the way that would be, as, a, as opposed to what I would more expect from the MK Ultra. It has this sort of like chemically back taste, but it is smooth other than a little bit of dryness that's in there. Not bad at all. Okay, so with the tinfoil hat, 
making sure we're protected from the government. What are we going to give MK Ultra from Aurora? I'm going to have to go and give this one a 3.7, doesn't make any sense, 3.7 fingers out of 5 fingers. A little bit off on the taste, not sure where I'm getting that chemically taste coming out of there. Um, it definitely was a little bit dry. But on the good side, visually the buds were beautiful, nice and sparkly, um, packed in there great, no real popcorn buds, that was great. The smell was nice, the smell was beautiful. The smell was probably the upper on this strain review, so I'll give that definitely high marks, bring that up a little bit higher. So that's going to wrap it up for us. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, you should smash on that like button. We, of course, want to have you be a part of the family, so make sure you subscribe. Make sure you just do yourself a favor, organize your life, ring the bell. You got one last thing to do, going down, checking which reviews are coming in. You'll know right away and make sure you check us out on the regular. All right, that's gonna be it for me. My name is Ryan, pack another bowl, I'm out.